Oh. Come on. Alright, I am gonna miss a hollow tape. Alright, maybe not the missile launcher right now. Door's lock is completely frozen over. The ice isn't too thick, so you might be able to get through it if you thaw or break the ice. Lighter. Thaw the ice. Break the ice. Break the lock. Breathe on the lock. Alright, let's thaw the lock. After a few minutes of dripping, the ice melts away. Awesome. Oh, that's a person. I wish I had a flamer. Alright. <coughs> Just wanted to check. Watch our fire. We're gonna blow up one of those canisters by accident. Gotta find the card. All right, there's the armory. Personal log, Director Burns. Last night, there was a catastrophic failure in the cryo lab. A burst pipe caused a cascade that froze over the entirety of the lab. I've quarantined the area until we've figured out what to do with it. Hopefully the mess doesn't spread. And then the mess spilled everywhere. You see anything, dude? Hey. So we are the mother load. Take all that you can carry. Oh. Is this thing working? Clay, report. We secured the armory and the ammo. Good to hear. That doctor lady fixed up the intercom system so I can communicate down here. Our radio's on the fritz. No. With all the stone and steel, the signal ain't getting to you. Unless we use hardwired connections like the intercoms. Good to know. Was there something you needed? Yeah. There should be some demolitions charges in there. We're gonna need those to blow this place to kingdom come. Grab them. You got it, boss. You heard him. Grab the explosives. <gasps> Julie's. <laughs> Oh, do they have a, uh... They gotta have a flamethrower down here, right? Hmm, maybe not. A lot of doolies. Oh my god, he's invisible? <laughs> oh, that's awesome. My god, they're evolving. Biolab sublevel, alright. My oh god. Excuse me. Report. We're back, Captain. And with the supplies. <laughs> First thing to go right around here in a long damn time. I feel like you've said that before. After how far south all Jameson went, I'm just relieved that things are finally going right. Must be the help of our new friend here. We fought a snowman. Who, me? Yes, you. Couldn't be. 
Just trying to be helpful. I'm just trying to get out of here. Just following orders, sir. You speak like a soldier already. I'll send your name up the ladder if you keep this up. Right. Well, with that sorted, we should have everything we need to head down and get this place unlocked. Just need to get that grease monkey to come with us. Guessing I'm gonna convince him? Seems like your specialty, or something. <laughs> I'll go talk to him. Good initiative. Keep it up. Did anyone poop in my corner? Disappointed no one pooped in my corner. Hi. What is it? I uh, heard you needed something. How do you feel about how everything went down? Siding with Kilgore was a little extreme. I was hoping there could be a solution with less bloodshed. Well, I like shooting things, so tell me about yourself. Well, I've been with the science team longer than the Gunners. I was part of their group when we set this place up. They do their experiments and I make sure the lights stay on. Pretty simple arrangement. Alright, I heard you needed something? Yeah, I figure you're gonna have to drag me down to the mainframe to get the security lockdown reset. I don't know if I'm too happy about that arrangement. Who said I needed your help? I know this bunker system's like the back of my hand. If anyone's your go-to guy, it's me. Alright. Maybe I can help you or convince you. Hmm. Convince. How so? I'm gonna break your legs. I'll keep you safe, don't worry. There's strength in numbers, you'll be fine. Let go of your fear. Together we can do anything. You're right. <laughs> You ready? Hell yeah, I am. Thanks for the pep talk. Of course. Did I level up? Oh, I did. Uh, let's get intelligence, intelligence up. <clears throat> this better be good. Oh, it's great. Colin's ready to go. I learned his name. Ah, that's his name. <laughs> Slipped my mind before. All right, good. We should be ready to head in and clean house. Clay! Wolf! You ready? You got yes, it. Yes, sir. Good. Let's go. We're gonna have a party. In the dangerous ice dungeon. Dangerous ice dungeon. Who do it do? Fighting snowman. From here to Timbuktu. Alright. Everyone hold on to your hats. Sorry, wrong one. Whoa. It's beautiful. All right, all right, I'll go first. Seems to be a thing. All right. Tuxedo. Sergeant Clay, I love you, but you gotta move, dude. You, you got it. thank you. Oh my god. Dear God! Was that Rhodes? I guess Frankenstein really was the monster after all. <laughs> Rhodes had a snack. Alright, I'm just keeping an eye out for these hollow tapes. Hmm. 
Damn it. Oh, oh, okay, yeah, sure. What the f- Famous thing. What the f- Famous thing. Idiot! <laughs> you stupid mother- Oh my god, I didn't kill myself. <laughs> oh god, no. Alright, this is... Clearly, I should restart. <laughs> Sergeant Clay, I'm glad you're still on my side. <laughs> hey, he didn't tell us about this, Clay. All right, I must have hurt him emotionally. Stand back. Jeez. Oh my god, the bravest engineer. Christ, Colin. Save some for us, man. My God. You're way too brave. Someone give Colin a gun so he doesn't have to run forward every time. All right. I gotta switch my BAR. I got a few custom. All right. Uh, we did have... Thank you, Private. Alan's terminal note. Damn terminals keep breaking down. It's a wonder these ancient things still work at all. I, I gotta talk to Brian's about getting more parts for these. My wife. My beautiful broom wife. Dark as balls in here in this room with no lights. Alright, before we go in there... You're right, Colin, you're right. I'll continue walking. Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh my god. Hey! I've got like 15 fuses. Alright, maybe not 15, I got like 3. You got a key, mister? Jesus Christ, guys. Project Deep Freeze. Project number thir 319, Elias Keim. Use cryogenic tech to keep our best and brightest alive for longer, only unthawing when they're needed. Dr. Keim has been unable to successfully revive any subjects that have been frozen for a prolonged period, but on the other hand, he successfully managed prototype, whoa, for weaponized cryo ray gun. Whoops, wrong one. Reborn. Create a suitable mutation to allow long-term hibernation project deep freeze. Dr. Coomer has managed to create a breed of mutant using ghouls' ability to hibernate for long periods of time, but has been unsuccessful in creating them with the ability to keep their higher motor functions. Air raid. Dr. Judith Whiteford. Use sub-audible frequencies to control the mutants created in Project Reborn. Dr. Whiteford has managed to successfully make a proof of concept where she can pacify and give simple commands to the feral mutants. Alright, so they finally got one. Burns Tape 5. We need to talk, Burns. Please call me Director Burns, Captain. Call me Director Burns. Oh, apologies, Mr. Director. But I'm taking command of this circus now. It burns when I pee. Excuse me? You know damn well that your ears work perfectly fine, Burns. You heard what I said. I'm taking command of this little... Jameson. ...of yours now. You 
bring us in for guard duty, letting those little pet scientists of yours do whatever the hell you want in the basement. And then, of course, one of their little pet projects gets out. Right. And now, three of my people and five of your people are dead. That's at least seven people. And what do you do? Pretend nothing happened. And that was just the first time. How many more times will that happen under your incompetence, Burns? Well, I don't plan to stand idly by and find out while you waste the lives of my men. I will not have you challenge my authority. I pay your salary. You, you can't do that. I'm pretty sure I can. What do you think you're doing? Nice wrench. Taking command. Now burn in hell. None of power. Please check all connections. So. <clears throat> oh, okay, Colin. You can't fix this, dude? God, why did we even bring you, Colin? Excuse me. This fuse box is what gives power to the server room door, but it's completely shot. Looks like two of the fuses need replacements. Jury rig. Just attach random wires. Alright. I kind of want to... I don't want to attach random wires. I think my luck is... Uh... Random wires. You nearly electrocute yourself with how poor your attempt to fix the fuse box was. But it seems to have worked. <laughs> oh, I love the skill checks. Oh. Looks like you're dumb as hell. All right, replace the fuses. You successfully managed to repair the fuse box somehow. Well, with fuses. Oh. Well, that was awesome. All right, all right. This is it. I'll get started on getting the lockdown sorted. Don't take too long. There's more of those things down here than I thought. Remember those explosives I had you grab? Oh. Um. Yeah, about. What do you want? Watch your mouth. <laughs> I need you to plant those on the reactor while we're down here. Why? Why can't you do it? Because I told you to do it. But why? So we can blow this place back to hell, dumbass. Oh, okay. I'm getting you now. Uh, okay, yeah, I'll get right on that. Be quick about it. And make sure you set the timer long enough for us to get out of here in time. Squirrel bits. Alright, first I'm gonna grab some random ammunition. Now I'm over here. Oh my god. I like how I took my rat away and then was immediately <laughs> given Radiation City. Ooh. When you go to plant the explosives, you realize the electronic detonator isn't set up correctly. If left unrepaired, it won't work. If repaired incorrectly, well, I think you know what'll happen. What could possibly go wrong? Uh oh. <laughs> Alright. Demolitions expert rewire circuitry repair the detonator. Alright. Lockdown should be shut off. We should be good to get out of here now. Good. Now we can. Dance. I just wanted to do the courtesy of thanking you boys for lifting the lockdown. You didn't lock the door, you idiot. Have oh. fun with my pets now. God, Jameson. <laughs> what the hell was that? She finished her Jameson. damn experiment! 
<sighs> I knew I shouldn't have left her alive. Now the beasts are more aggressive than ever. We need to get back up there and kill that crazy Jameson. Well, someone didn't lock the door. Oh my god. Oh, I put my hat and breaching boots on. Aim for the legs. Oh my god, dude. He's pooping. Not the leg, whatever. You survived? How? Oh, you know, some scotch tape, some duct tape. Why the hell did you betray us? You were just going to get in the way of our experiments. Besides, more test subjects is always useful to have. It's not that easy to kill me. Those mutants aren't that tough. I, su <laughs> I survive because I'm not a Jameson. It's not that easy to kill me. Hmm, yes, well, we'll see about that. Huh, well, no matter. I'll just take care of you myself. I'm sorry, Judith. Oh, yeah. And I'm sorry to you, too. I didn't know that she had become so consumed by her work that she would attempt something like this. Don't sass me, Wolf. Go check on the elevator. Yes, boss. You planted the explosives, right? Yes, sir. On the reactor? Yeah, you planted them, right? On the reactor. Nah, I ate him. I don't need your sass either. <laughs> yeah, I planted him. Good. Provided you weren't an idiot, that timer should be long enough for us to get the hell out of Dodge. Wolf, elevator, status. It's on its way. Give it a minute. We don't have a minute. More mutants are on the way. Well, Jameson. Ain't got nowhere to run. All right, everyone dig in. We have to hold our ground here. Hey. Oh, hello there. We're going to die. Oh man, I gotta leave my camp here. Oh, 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 oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh my god. Ow. Oh, you fucking idiot. I didn't mean to hit you. Someone just got murdered. Oh, yeah. Doctor, we have to go now. Sorry, 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 sorry. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. Whew. Oh, everyone all right? Hi. <sighs> Never thought I'd see the surface again, to be honest. <laughs> but hell, we got out of there alive. And all thanks to your help. <laughs> Damn fine work in there. Here, I want you to have this as thanks. Hey, he gave me his gun. Awesome. 50% 50 50 more fruit to perdur. 50% more damage against ghouls and mutants. Thanks for the gun. Thank you very much. Make good use of it. It's my personal 44. You've earned it. What now? We'll be going back to Gunner HQ. 
And hopefully we get assigned as far away from the Jameson possible. If I happen to see you again, I might have to think twice about any contracts you have on your head. Oh, you better believe it. Anything else you need? No. Oh, you've done damn well helping us out. Can't ask you for anything else. I guess this is... Goodbye, Captain Kilgore. Safe travels, friend. When I get back to HQ, I'll be sure to shoot your name up the chain of command. Hopefully they take this report seriously, and all the others might think twice before gunning for your head. <laughs> <laughs> Private Wolf? Hey there. Hey, uh, thanks for all your help down there. Of course, Private. Sergeant Clay? Hi. Appreciate your help down there. Appreciate you. Callan? <clears throat> You did good work down there. Appreciate you managing to get us out of there alive. Your brave mother trucker. Hi. I thank you for getting me out of there alive. I'm unsure what I'll do now, but I want you to have this. Oh, the freeze gun. Yes, thanks for the gun. Make good use of it. It's my experimental cryo ray. Hell yeah. What are you going to do? I sincerely doubt there's many job openings on the surface for scientists with a background in cryo and audio engineering. However, I'm certain I could try and hawk it as a doctor. Especially with all this blood on my, uh, handkerchief. Anything else you need? No. You've done more than enough. Thank you, friend. I guess this is goodbye as well. Indeed. Farewell, and safe travels. Alright, let's check out this cryo gun and the captain's... Captain's gun. Alright, so this... 50% 50, uh, 50 damage against ghouls and mutants. Sorry, mister. I'm gonna shoot you in the head now that you're frozen. <laughs> Give me a second. Oh. Someone's gonna be angry. Alright. Damn, this is... Super useful. There we go. Oh my god, what the f <laughs> Yeah, teamwork. Does not work too well on the behemoth. Hey, Mr. Behemoth. I'm gonna gump you. Hey, man, I helped you. Awesome. This is super, super useful. Heck yeah. All right. Let's uh, head back, everyone, and uh, get a different ending. Ow. <coughs>